Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're taking a deep dive into the world of Moto apps with Modify, a Magisk module that brings back all the cool features you might miss on a Nong Motorola phone running Android 12 or later. We already covered the installation process in a separate video video link available in description, so let's jump straight into what Modify offers in this updated version. What's new? Dot, dot, Modi FY 2.0 brings a bunch of exciting additions, AI drawing. Unleash your inner artist with this AI-powered sketching tool. It can generate AI-powered images just by typing the prompt. Moto icons, get those iconic Moto app icons back in your launcher. Adaptive cloud services. Back up your gallery, notes, calendar, and more for a seamless experience across devices, Smart Connect Desktop. Control your phone from your PC with Smart Connect, but keep in mind you'll need a separate program for your computer. Modify 2.0 also addresses some issues from the previous version. Dialer, Contacts, and Messages these core apps should now function properly even on loss-based ROMs, Moto Launcher. Themes, icons, and fonts are back in action, but you'll need the Lenovo Store app for downloading them. At a glance removal, say goodbye to the pre-installed at a glance widget and replace it with something you actually use. Moto Launcher Developer Options. Access more granular control over location permissions and other settings. Smart service and widget permissions, fixed permissions for calendar and message-related features. Modify is a fantastic option for anyone who wants that classic Moto experience on their Android phone. With AI drawing, Moto icons, and improved cloud backup functionalities, Modify 2.0 offers a compelling package. However, keep in mind that Smart Connect for desktop requires additional software and is still under development. If you're looking to customize your phone and get access to some handy Moto features, Modify is definitely worth checking out. Don't forget to check out the installation video in the description below for a smooth setup process. As always, thanks for watching and leave a comment below if you have any questions.